Well, hello everybody and welcome to my channel. Um, today is just a tutorial outline. Uh, recently, me and my friend Rowan, we've been trying to get onto the same Minecraft server as you can see. I've got one here. and It kept coming up for him saying that he was unable to connect. So, believe not, I have a solution. Now, I think this is the first one on YouTube that shows this method. So hopefully this will be good. So basically what you've got to do is you've got to start off by going to start and control panel. Now bearing in mind I'm doing this on Windows 7. So for Windows Vista and XP it'll be a little different. The next thing you want to do is go down until you find your Windows firewall. Now this is basically where your computer blocks things that it thinks is going to harm your computer. And the port for your Minecraft server the computer's automatically picked up as it's going to harm it. So what we need to do is if we go into our advanced settings right up there it'll take us to this window this advanced window and if we go into our inbound rules these are all of the rules that the, the computer or windows on the computer has allowed us to use all the darker ones are ones that they haven't been used in a while so they they've turned themselves off so what we're going to do is we're going to go over here to new rule and because it's a minecraft server we want it to be a minecraft port so we're going to click on port and go next now you're going to leave all this and the specific port you're going to use now if you go into your minecraft server and go to your server.txt no we don't where do we go your uh, property files for your server you can see here that you've got the port as, or I've got mine as 25565, which I believe is mainly the default one anyway. So what we're going to do is we're going to put in 25565 into our server port and click next. And we're going to allow the connection no matter what. You're going to leave this as fine because this will mean people outside of your, your wireless access will be able to get onto your server. And I'm just going to call it Minecraft Server Port. Um, the port for my Minecraft server. Okay, so we're going to click on Finish. And that's done. As you can see, it's come up here for Minecraft Server Port. Port. All you've got to do now is just close the window. And then load up your Minecraft. Go onto your server. And your friends should be able to join your server. Uh, if not... Well, if not, give me a message back. I will have a look. Um, what I'll do is I'll make an update to this video at some point uh, with Rowan helping me, who can record his side of the view of what he sees. Okay, guys, so that's basically how to get your Minecraft server working if you can't port forward your wireless router. So, thanks for watching the video, guys, and I'll see you next time.